Great news everyone, it's episode 3, and I for one could not be more excited. So we've made a little bit of progress, up to 7% on the best diary, a bit of a tiny little bit grinding off camera. See, I'm just missing one from one of that one. Yeah, only small get grinding. Got off Jade and Jedward up to level 6. And we're going straight for the white knight. More flawless transitions. I think in a few episodes time I'm just going to let the MIDI music play and stop doing the <laughs> silly iTunes play is what I'm doing now. And then I do put the um, orchestral songs on for the big moments. Stuff like um, the final dungeon, final boss and all that. Right, I think I'm on full health already, just in case. Yeah. Right, so it should be nice and simple, just have me and Jade attacking and uh, Jedward on the heels. I'm going to pause the emulation there. I don't know what music plays here, so I'm just going to let it be silent. So where is the white knight? It's where he's supposed to be. Give it a bit longer. We'll give it a bit longer. You can never say no in a Dragon Quest game where you end up in an infinite loop. Every single time. Alright, we've waited till night time. Where is he? Still no sign of him. Yeah, let's just head back to Storeway. There's no way he's going to be like on the hill or anything. So let's just keep walking back. Uh oh. Oh, he's on the hill. Oh, no, I didn't see that coming. Man on a pony. What do you want? Who am I? Uh, I don't know. A guardian of Angel Falls or some shit. I ain't got no princess, bruv, but it's battle time. Oh no, it's a wrong one. Fuck! Perfect! <laughs> right. Play this nice and simple, I think. Just have me and Joe attacking and then the Jedward boys on defending and healing. I'm not gonna try egging on anything. It's not too bad. Won't be a one hit, two hit kill. Not too bad. It's annoying that I'm not getting that one point two damage because one of Jedi is always quicker. Should be fine. Should be nice and simple as well. This thing is going massively wrong. I'll take him up to level 7. There we go. We got a 1.2 that time. I should have healed there. I don't know why I didn't. Well, I'll have Jade defend next time. Should be fine. Uh, you heal, John. You're on higher health. Giving us a turn off anyway. Alright, back to the second. Gonna have to heal it. Nice thing about having two healers. One heal is already able to defend. So he can still defend. Easy game, easy game. Alright, I think that should be fine. I'm on loop, I think. <laughs> I need to cut down, oh dear. Let's cut down the leg for these tracks. He's got the most health. You heal, John. There we go. I 
I think early game you could realistically have three attackers on one hero. But just to keep it consistent with the later game, we'll stick with this. Now, I'm still thinking about the um, vocations that we're going to have. I think once we get to All Trades Abbey, both Zack and Jade make them into gladiators straight away. And then leave John and Edward as a priest. And keep that going for like the bulk of the main and post game. Like, I only start thinking about paladins when we get to like, stupid iron levels. I reckon he must be semi nearly dead. I reckon he's on a court. Um, bother healing. Yeah, got him. Let's deal that with next turn. Yeah, that's a lightning thrust. He's not going to survive. Good job, that. Perfect time for the kill. Oh. Playing the same tactic, because he can't do resurrecting. So he buys himself like three turns every time he does that. I'm only doing like 10 damage a turn. I've got to maintain the same tactic, there's not much else we can do. If we're playing all offensive, we'll have John and Edward attack just to build up the multipliers, but there's no guarantee they'll actually hit. I'll probably do zero. No, we'll keep it the same. He's healing faster than I can do damage. <laughs> this boss fight isn't meant to be hard, it's boss number two for God's sake. Should have got any abilities, I should Dragon Slash. We'll do that, I don't think it makes any difference at all. But... We'll leave him. Maybe it does one or two extra, but it's not going to add up to much. Uh -oh. I think I was the liability. I think I'll keep that. Right, Edward needs a heal next turn. Ooh, crit. But not enough yet. Hopefully, John doesn't take too much. Uh oh! They've got such good chemistry. Right. I think we're gonna need two heals here. Have John heal himself and then heal Jay. Shit! Now we're in trouble. Just when I said it. The comeback of dreams. Unfortunately, that is really going to piss with my OC... Oh, unless... No, it is going to piss my OCD because they're going to be on different XP now. Yeah, Edward's level 7, John's only 6. They have to be identical. They have to be. Can't have it any other way. Ooh, shiny. I'm going to have to go to Angel Falls and get... Like, just kill a slime for 1 XP just so John levels up and they're even again. <laughs> I'm just going to have to hack it even. <laughs> Alright, White Knight's complaining now. That's weird, I died and I'm back. It's almost like I am essential to the story. Uh-oh, the White Knight's got confused. He can see Stella, but no one else can. He's got a hint of magic about him, yes. 
She's really not Princess Mona, man. She's Princess Simona. Silly bastard. He is the White Knight. And Mona is his princess. Must do the honour thing and return to the castle. I'm not sure about that, my friend. Well, all is well. He just has to find his way home and we just have to go back to Stormway and say it's all fine. Here's the meadows. Lovely. <laughs> Right, we have a dead half a Jedward with us, so uh, must not kill anything, must not gain XP while John is dead. Use nothing attack, use nothing attack. Ooh, shiny. I can't remember what they're used for, to be honest. Kogan. They're alchemy something. Right, let's resurrect this paintbrush hair twat and then get back on with it. I don't know, have I even got the church music? I don't think I have. We'll settle with this. Resurrect John, please. Bloody churches always wanting contributions. He's back and healthy, and so am I for an unknown reason. Right, I don't think you can get in at night, so go and rest at the lovely inn. Get my hand on the trigger ready, this is going to be a seamless transition. Oh no, I'm not in it. <laughs> Quick. Oh. Seamless. Right, I don't think I'm going to spend any money on more shopping just yet, because I want to wait till we get to Coffinwell and buy a load of chainmails. Because they look sweet. As far as I remember, this is the only game in which every item makes an actual difference to your appearance. Because in most games, there's only like a few set outfits for every character. But obviously in this, everyone's customizable, and every armor piece matters. The princess wants to go and see the white knight. Never fear, I am here. Everyone says that. Right. Great news, old man. The White Knight is a good man. Yes. Yes. Ah, fuck you know. He don't trust me. Until I put a stop to him for once and for all, I can't get any reward. That's the whole reason I did this. Oh. What's a foolish man? Oh, Princess run off again. This time I'll best chase her proper. Oh, there she is. Sounds hot. It's about Brigadoom. I knew that must have had something to do with the story. Why would he have said it otherwise? Lovely music it kicks in just as we have our erotic chat. Oh, it's telling me about nursery rhymes. Well, maybe I haven't got in with it, but it must have been close. 
tiny woodish to the west of Loch Storm. Zia. The White Knight needs help. Well, we'll go and see what we can do. So we're off to Zia. I don't think Zia has any sort of pun. As far as I can tell, I think it is just to set up the um, the pun later in the game. No spoilers just yet, but there's another version of Zia. Yeah, unless it's meant to just be like over Zia or something rubbish like that. Don't know. Nothing I can think of, but. Right, so that's what I must do. I must go to the item shop, go back to Angel Falls, kill the slime for 1 XP, have John level up so they're perfectly even again so my OCD isn't ruined. This is a central part of the game. We cannot have two of the exact same people being on slightly different helps. No, oh, yeah, they're in. Yes, that's fine. Chuck him in the bag. Alright, and what we're going to do... I know I am taking the piss with cheats a little bit, but I've assigned a speed-up button to R2. And because we're playing music off a separate source, it doesn't make any difference to the soundtrack. Lovely thinking, that. So I am semi-cheating. Oh, Hills and Meadows. Uh, there we go. Seamless. Right, now we need a slime. We need one slime with no accompaniments. Where are the slimes? Please! No slime in the bushes. No, uh, going back into Angel Falls. Hello everyone, goodbye everyone. Please, there must be one. <laughs> one slime, that's all I want. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Don't run from me. Alright, lovely. Right, hopefully it's on its own. No, flee. <laughs> this is essential. We cannot have John and Edward being on separate levels or separate EXPs. Slime, please. Please. <laughs> please. Slime! Please be on your own. Yeah. Nice and easy. One XP. Job done. Please be one. Yes. And they both got one as well, so it's even. And I've leveled up as well. Let's keep whacking it all in sword. And John's leveled up. Beautiful. It's even. The crisis is averted. Now back to Stormweight. And then off to Zia. Yeah, I'm going to do the speed up every time doing heal all as well, because that sound just drives me mental. Might as well do it here. So we're cheating a little bit. We're not doing any like game changing cheats. Just ones to make quality of life a bit nicer. Right, I've got these guys in the best diary already. So we could ignore all of them. Don't need to level up just yet. Please be something better than a cow fat. Could have done with one of them a minute ago. Right, might as well just ice this. Nice and quick. So I think I'm running about five times speed when I press the speed up. I think. Ooh, sunset. What a beautiful day. Alright, any new monsters up here? I think he's new. This is another type of hammerhood. Yeah, that's new. Alright, let's whack them. think of any like real world resemblances to this place like a place with a big tree in the middle that's Scottish a hundred percent unless it's ear this is the island of ear in Scotland 
The one that's got a population of like 50. I think that's it. Support. Let's try it. Yes, you can do it. <laughs> I don't think in any of my playthroughs I've ever had that in mind. <laughs> but there you go. That's what you get when you explore a little bit. I don't think I've ever been in that inn either. It's crumbling and broken. So this is another village without an angel, a guardian angel. A sad tale. Oh, am I too late? Alright, I might have to actually use the end for the first time then if I can't get into um old lady house. I don't actually remember being told to go here, but I know <laughs> I know instinctively, because this person is 3D, that this is where I must be. Oh god's sake! Right, speed up, can't be bothered. Run! Run, Jedward, run! It's a lovely looking inn. Yes, bed me please. Uh, now here we go. Right, now we can speak to uh, whoever it is I'm supposed to be talking to who I can't remember. We... fuck knows. Hello! I've broken into your house to make you recite a nursery rhyme. I hope that's fine. Go for it. Let's have a sing song. The right knight. Hmm. An alternative name for a white knight. Oh dear. So the White Knight was meant to kill the beast, so he could come home and get married, and then fucking disaster. How tragic. So we best head to Brig of Doom. Let's go straight there. I imagine we'll see the um the White Knight at Brig of Doom. I can't imagine he would like, you know, do something stupid like ambush the town and ride in. Oh no, what's happening? Oh no, the White Knight's ambushing the town, riding straight in. Oh. Why do you run from me when I'm galloping towards you in a horse? That is weird, actually. That is weird. Ooh. A witch. It is I, Zack. Yeah, I heard a nursery rhyme. Hope it helps. There's a song about him he's never heard. It must be like he's significantly older than he seems. Right, Hills and Meadows? Seamless. Right. Kelpa? Oh, that's wonderful. I can't remember what. <laughs> they used an alchemy somewhere, I can't remember where. But that's a part of every Dragon Quest game as well. There's always a horse poo or a cow poo that becomes relevant later on. Always. Alright, so I can't remember these are. Don't need them. I can just buy them at the shop. Might be a change of music, I can't remember. No, it's not. <laughs> it's not until we get the Brig of Doom. Right. More enemies? Yes. We'll put the battle on for this one. Battle! Lovely. Just keep it on for a little bit, just because we want to get their starry up. Oh dear, that is a heavy hit. Might have to make Jedward defend. Nearly dead. Oh, go on, double damage. Calm. Seven defend. Keep him safe. Don't want Jedward running into trouble. They are national treasures. 
Oh, it's gonna be more and more. I think this does call for a speed up. I don't wanna have to flee, so hopefully they don't summon any more. Like that could be quite useful. Uh, but completely unnecessary. Finish him off. We'll leave battle on because we want to get some more enemies into this time. Both of these are new, I can't decide. Be a pun for you. Come on, it's speed. Done. Speed was not necessary. Right, still need the skeleton for the best bio. Don't need the brown anymore. Got the brownie already. Skeleton. Uh, Jedward can attack, why not? Oh dear, double damage? Yeah! 48 is big damage this early on. Okay. Nice and quick, we finish off. Job done. Oh, Jed would level up. Oh, they've got buff. That is a very useful spell. Fuck me, fireworks. <laughs> That's actually made my heart go. Oh dear. Right. Um, is there any other monsters that we're going to need to kill? I'm not going to go left for him. I think there's a mini meadow up there, but not going to bother with that. Right. <laughs> It's cavern music time. Oh dear! The kingdom is ruined! I did not anticipate this. How can he be away? How can he have been away for so long? And where's Mona? Right straight towards that gate, why don't you? Fucking mom. Right. New enemy? New enemy. Should have yeah okay we need to <laughs> should have healed before that. Oh dear John's gonna be on low MP. Mage please. They can attack. Why not? There's a mages. Let's have a check on them. Gee. Have I ever been down here? <laughs> Why just. No. Oh. <laughs> I thought I'd just bypassed the big part of it, but no. You can't do that, apparently. Right. Let's check the best diary while we're here. I can't be able to play this type of music, but. Ah, uh, whatever. It's up to 9% already by episode 3. I still must be missing whatever that is. I can't think off the top of my head, unless it's something on the beach. Missing a few more things in here. No, not something on the beach. Alright, I'm sure we'll find it. It's not the end of the world if we miss a few things out on the way. Whoop, new m &E. We'll just have to go back and kill some stuff. Later again. Job done, nice and easy. I think it's only treasure up here, but it's a completionist run, we've got to do it all. Mini metal. Fuck! Nice bandana though, I slapped that on me bombs. 
Oh, it looks lovely, doesn't it? Fashion icon I am. Ooh, enemy! Oh dear. Uh, oh, tactics now. Slime first. Oh, it does look wonderful, that bandana. And no other game has this level of customization. Or well, no other Dragon Quest game. Though. So yeah, hopefully, I don't know, I've not read much news about Dragon Quest XII. Hopefully it's similar to this in that, although I appreciate the voiced um, companions, so that's the one disadvantage of this game, you can never communicate with your companions unless you edit in something entertaining for them to say. Like that, which I presumably did in the editing. May or may not have happened. Ooh, Emony! Should hear at some point. <laughs> Just checking that didn't go the wrong track. Yeah. Alright. If I do heal all, John's gonna run out of MP by the time we get there. Oh dear. Decisions, decisions. Wait, oh. I, I think I've got these guys already, haven't I? Run away! Oh dear. Pretty sure this is the right way. Yeah. Got any treasure up there? No. Got them already. Uh, right, I'm gonna go the wrong way, get the treasure. Presume there is some. <laughs> Can't really remember. Yeah, nice. Double treasure. Ooh, hello. New Emony. So I think, I'm pretty sure. Same in other drug systems as well. If you approach an enemy from behind, they're more likely to do that and give you a bonus turn. Lovely. Pair of clogs. Mini medal! This is the one game where they get the mini medals right in the kind of balance between. Well, in every other game, you just. It's just an endless mini medal grind and you get no treasure for ages. But in this one, it kind of balances quite nicely. Alright, I should probably put those clogs on someone. I refuse to put them on Jedwards. Because they must look identical. They must. Ah, I should have healed. Oh well. Sorry, I can run away. Oh dear. Don't use Zam, please. I don't think I've ever seen that spell. Right, now we can unlock the shortcut. Oh no, no I can't. Oh. <laughs> must need the ultimate key. I'm not going to bother getting in the, any of the alchemy recipes as well. Because in this game you can just Google them all. Not like 11, where you have to actually get them all. Um, go south for treasure, I think. Yeah, here though. Actually, there's nothing down there, is there? Nice. Right. Oh, wrong way. Straight up. Is this a shortcut? That is a shortcut, right. I was going to say I could go and restore health now, but you know what? Billy Big Bollocks, we're not going to bother. Just get rid of these guys. I've probably got another level up due soonish. I don't think I've ever died to the next boss fight. Ever. Touch wood. Level up for Jade. Trying sorts. Yeah, I think this is a relatively straightforward boss fight. more leveled than I usually would be, because I don't usually go for the 100% of this diary straight away. Let's see if we get any treasure in here. Ooh, lovely. Alright, let's chuck these clogs on. Yeah, we'll chuck them on Jade. Yeah. And I'll just get Bracer. I'll give one of them to Jedward. They need it more than Jade does. And they still look identical, so it's fine. Anything else in here? Don't think so. I think this room does become a part of a one of the downloadable quests. I don't think there's anyone in I should download those really before anything else. Right, let's have a Jade. I don't think there's anything else we can do to prep for this one. 
it's the witch! Morag. I can't work out any reference, but... I'm sure there is a real world Brigadoon with an N. Which I presume this is what Brigadoon is based on. But I don't know anything about it. I might have to Google that one afterwards. She's got a Scottish accent, definitely. But I don't know the reference. Where is Mona? Whoops. Oh dear. He's been insta-yeeted. The earthquake broke the spell she placed on him. Oh. Interesting. Is the White Knight fucked? He's fucked. Right. We'll do this on our own then. Come on in. I am here to steal the uh, White Knight. I think. I don't know. I'm just here for the ride. Uh oh. Boss fight. Oh no. Not yet. <laughs> Good timing. Ooh, boom! We've resisted the curse. So this is the same as Dragon Quest VIII when the hero can't be cursed. In VIII it's because he already had a curse on him by the Dragovians, and in IX because he's a Celestrian. He or she. Gonna have to make my pretty face a whole lot less lovely! Oh. Perfect timing! Right, let's run with I think same tactics as before, just go for the attacks. And then Jedward on healing. No, it doesn't attack twice per turn. I don't think it's later in the until later in the game that they attack twice per turn. It's only the legacy bosses that are really famous. It's fine. We'll leave that on hill. Jed would have gotten in the way here. We would have had a multiplier down the other. Jade next turn. <laughs> can John do anything useful without any MP? I don't think he can. Uh, oh, I've not even given him any medicinal herbs. I should have done that to be honest. Oh well. Oh dear. We're all fine. I think that was a curse. I think we all resisted. <laughs> Shouldn't be any problems with this one. I think we're sufficiently leveled not to stumble into any issues. Your Jade next turn again. Think about HP Hoover. I think I'm right in saying every ability that the boss has got is you can use as well. That's what I'm about. I could have buffed, I forgot to buff. Oh well, don't think we did it. Oh dear, John is paralysed. He was fucking useless enough already, and now he's completely out of the game. Yeah, every ability is unlockable. Just not yet. I think. I just thought Magic Burst was going to be a major ability. Oh dear, John's in trouble again. played this mage before. Like, I've never been able to use a mage in this game, so I just find them all to be completely useless. In the they might be good early game. Please don't die. Oh. Fuck! Oh, they're gonna ruin it. I'm gonna have to hack their XP now to make them even again. Oh, that's the one bit of cheating I will allow. I'm not making any game-breaking hacks, but... or cheats. Just to settle my OCD. I think we're all good. I don't think he's got too much health either, so should be fine. Just thinking. 
don't actually know what the music plays when um there we go Dragon Quest 9 LGBTQ friendly I don't know what the music plays when um the boss fight's over because there's a nice one coming up but uh, we're good keep on the attack must be nearly dead now Hundred percent. This is the ending kill. Fine. Whoa. Go on. End at the end of the track, please. Yeah. Perfect. It's nice when things work out. Oh, we've got evac. Nice. Let's Edward level up. Yeah, I'm going to have to hack their XP's. <laughs> I can't have them not be equal. Things are looking up. Level up for Jade as well. Nice. And a pair of high heels. Easy. Right. I don't think there's any music here. Alright, turn world together. No more. You can't turn back the centuries. Beloved Mona is no more. Oh no. No more Mona. It can't be true. Uh, <laughs> I have to pick good music now. That's the one. That's got to be the one. I probably played it prematurely, but I'll stick with that. And yet. Passing time has destroyed his homeland and his queen. It's a tragic tale. Or is it? It's Princess Mona! Aren't you? Oh, maybe it's not. Maybe it's Princess Simona. So I think the implication here is that Princess Simona is like the ancestor of Princess Mona. Does that mean she had an affair and had a child that went on to be... That is his ancestor, or...? No, that doesn't make sense. Unless he's now having a romantic dance with, like, his... Child's child's child. Oh, actually, no. They must have... She must have been... They must have had the baby before the marriage. <laughs> That's the only way this makes sense, I think. Uh-oh. It looks like the curse she hit him with was fatal. He knew she wasn't Mona, but he can die in peace now. Oh, hang on. <laughs> I have to restart it because it goes into another song. Oh, maybe she only inherited the memories of loving Mona. So maybe she's not definitely... Okay, maybe she is. <laughs> I can't decide. But yeah, I think she's an ancestor of Princess Mona. He has only regrets. No regrets. Only gratitude. And there he goes. R.I.P. Right slash white knight. She heard a voice. She was saying thank you. Princess Mona communicating from the dead. What a tragic tale. Even more tragic, I don't think I've got any more Chimera wings left, so I can't teleport back. Ah, oh, what a terrible shame. And they've even given me a spot from which to fling one. Oh dear. I do have one! Yeah! that change music back. Seamless. Right, need to resurrect John again. Looks like he's the more simple brother. He's got himself killed twice now. Both to the right knight and to Morag. <sighs> Terrible. I always preferred you more, Edward. You are always my favourite. Is. 
the zero MP wonder. And he's lost the level. I've sorted that out in between recordings. Because <laughs> I can't be asked having them uneven. It's going to be the same when me and Jade become gladiators. They're going to have to be even and have exactly the same skill points. I think in the later game though, you're meant to have one fast priest and one slow one. So you try and get healing before the enemy attacks, and then another one afterwards. I think that's meant to be the strat anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go back to the old um, Lord Roto Bad Badger tutorials. Right, let's go and report the sad news. The White Knight was a good guy, but he's dead. But so is the Witch at least, so that's at least something. And I'm gonna get my reward. And a tough old time, but yes. All's well that ends well. Treasure chamber? Yeah. And he's opened up the Eastern Checkpoint. That's going to be helpful. He gives a grotto map. I think. I'm not sure how early in the game you can get the grotto map. I don't think it's the level 1 one, either. Yeah, <laughs> too early in the game to be thinking about grottos, but I just want to check if speaking to him again gets it after I've got this trailer. Be interesting. Right. Back to the treasure guessing game. Blues are random. Don't care about them. Right. One of them's a gold rosary. Fuck. <laughs> I wouldn't have got that right. This one's a gold rosary. No. <laughs> this one's a gold rosary. Yeah. <laughs> I knew one of them was money. One of them was gold rosary. Couldn't remember which. Right. Let's give that to someone then. I think... The other Edward can have that one, given that John's already got gold bracer. And it boosts magical mending. It'd be wasted on everyone else. All's well as it ends well. Got a pair of iron gauntlets in the bag as well. Right? Forgot about them. We can buy another pair once we get to um coffin well anyway. But, but the style points are off the chain right now. Right, speak to the king again. I don't think he'll give the grotto map to me this early, but Try it just in case. Nah. Not yet. Alright, let's see what this village has to say. Looks like everyone here thinks I'm the flea's knees. Dog's bollocks. Cat's elbows. Shark's teeth. Well, loads of benevolence, but you can't see it. Next stop, Starfire Express. It's bound to launch this time. No way it won't. Right, well, Hills of Meadows. Uh. Smooth. Actually, I'll kill one um, enemy. So hopefully that'll level John up. But they're still going to be uneven. Oh, well, we'll have to make do of it for now. Hack it in later. For a one hit kill stage. There we go. Hopefully they aren't too uneven. Let's get them shields as well, given they've got some block chance then. And Starflight time. So I don't know what the music's supposed to be in here exactly the flapping sign. Oh dear. Sure it'll perk up once we get inside. I've heard that before. It wasn't true then, but hopefully it'll be true now. Ooh. Exactly the same, but... Ooh. whole thing moved around when I came in. When I came in?
giving me back some of my celestial powers. Wonderful. It will fly, but we need to help more people. In that case, off to Coffin World. Right, let's check the best diary while we're here. I think I've probably missed out some um, enemies now. We're up to 10%. Wonderful. 10% on a 100% game completion already. I know it doesn't quite work out that way. Oh, so I got... That must have been a Drac Mage, which I was missing earlier. I'm missing whatever that one is. I'm not going to remember it off the top of my head, but... Maybe we'll see that one on the way to Coffin World. I don't know. Alright, let's run straight there. Use the new PC Mega Run feature. 100% in vanilla Dragon Quest. Still a bit for June. I don't know where this rates in this the, the overworld thing. I don't know where it rates. I think it's definitely better than the Dragon Quest 11 overworld. Because I never play that one. But Dragon Quest 8 overworld is so good. I think Dragon Quest 8 easily is the best soundtrack of all the games. So far that is. But Dragon Quest 12, I believe, is posthumously still scored by Koichi Sugiyama. I think. So I don't know what's going to happen there. I imagine if they, well, I imagine they will do future games after 12. I imagine they'll have to get a new composer in. Don't know how that's going to go. So yeah, for those that don't know, Koichi Sugiyama did has scored all of the Dragon Quest games. He came aboard, did, I think, right at the very start, in 1980 or whatever it was. And he died only. I think he died this year. Or it might have been late last year. Yeah, he was 96, 97. So he did quite well for himself. Yeah, no longer with us sadly, but I'm pretty sure he posthumously did the score for Dragon Quest XII. So we're still going to get to see some of his compositions in the future. Right, here we go. First monster of Coffin World. Let's chuck the battle music on. Because I remember <laughs> these guys are pricks. They keep summoning more friends to fight with. Right, let's kill some more things. There's a tanky birdie. Hot work cooker. My nails, lovely. Can't remember what they're used for, but it'd be something alchemy based. Anything new up here? Yep, Cartman. We love him. He's tanking. Oh dear, Edward's in trouble. For once, he isn't the best brother. Oh no, he's uneven! Fuck! I can't have a level 10 and a level 9 Jedi. They are, as the world knows, exactly the same. There's literally nothing different about either. Any more enemies? I don't think there is. Maybe we'll find some more on the way in, but... Um, I think this is... No, it's not that one, is it? It's going to be the... <laughs> I think it's that one, I think. Because Coffinwell is, as this bloke will tell us, it's a bit down in the dumps. They've all got the plague. It might just be the normal village music for here. But... Stagnant air coming from the west. How very interesting and probably consequential. It's dead as a door now. Well, this place is in a terrible state of affairs. Go and have a word with the mayor. Mayor Laria. If you haven't worked out this pun already, Malaria. <laughs> I think everyone in here has got a pun name. I don't know what it's a reference. I don't know what this place in general is a reference to. It's just a general plague town. I don't think there's any like accents per se. But right. While we're here, let's do a bit of shopping. It's gonna be. It's gonna be four chain nails. Lovely suit of armour for early game. Yes, I do. Bring me up to 61. I pretty much buy them just because they <laughs> they look good. <laughs> one for John and one for Edward. I 
don't think is there any other armor we want to get. Bronze armor's a waste. Could you, I can't get turban to Jedward and carry up, cu cover up their hair. We will get them shields though. I think just for Jedward, and then that's the end of my money because they've got a bit of extra block chance as well. Another shell shield. Lovely that. Let's play it again. Alright, can sell the fan, don't need that. Sell both of these. I don't think we're gonna get enough for nah. Can't be bothered. Let's rumble. Alright, I think how long have we got? That's fifty six minutes episode. I think we shall leave it there. So in the next episode we're gonna get to the bottom of what's going on in this in this hellhole of a town. It's down in the dumps. We need to sort it out. Get some benevolence. And until then, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.